Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Random Martin here, and this is the final part of WWE 2K15 2K Showcase. One more match. And if you haven't seen the second to last part of WWE 2K15 2K Showcase, one more match, I would highly suggest you go check out that second to last part before checking out the final part. But for the final part, we'll have, yet again, Gordon vs. Christian, Capital Punishment June 19, 2011, Washington, D.C. So, with that being said, here we go! Skip that, because we're already gone for that one. Here we go. Randy Orton is an eight-time world champion. Randy Orton has been cleared to compete tonight at Capital Punishment. A lot has been made over a concussion Randy Orton suffered at the hands of Christian a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, you know, Michael, I had a chance to speak with Randy Orton earlier today, and I asked him about what the symptoms of the concussion were like. He said it felt strange. That it was hard to focus on things. They can forget subtle things like your name or your friend's name. That could be a major factor in a match like this. But Randy is medically cleared to compete. Yep. There he is, the current World Heavyweight Champion, Randy Orton. And he is defending the World Heavyweight title yet again for the third time. Actually, actually his fourth, I'll say this. But this time, third with this certain individual. Terribly bitter man. 
He won the world title and lost it five days later to Randy Orton and blames the WWE Universe for voting to put him in that match. Well, Christian used to respect his peeps. I'll tell you, I'm getting goosebumps just waiting for the bell to ring. Christian's turned his back on his fans and I personally think it's going to help this Randy Orton, the eight-time world champion, 2009 Royal Rumble winner, and third-generation superstar is set to defend his title. And with everything that's transpired, I think the fighter is going to come out with more emotion than we've ever seen it. At one point, you could say these men were bonded by mutual respect after Christian's assault on Randy Orton. That went right out the window. Christian. Ah, jeez. With a concussion Randy Orton sustained, I have a feeling he was going to come to capital punishment to defend the championship with it or without medical clearance. Well, I think Randy remembered what happened when a man both he and Christian know very well was forced to forfeit the world title due to injury, and that's Edge. And as many will remember, Edge was forced to relinquish the World Heavyweight Championship in 2007 due to injury. Yeah, well, that was a piece of history that Randy did not want to be responsible for repeating, concussion or not. The fighter would never back down from a championship match. He just planted it with a DDT. Here we go. A sick deck breaker. Randy Orton's been on the shelf thanks to Christian. He's got a lot of pit-up frustration that he's looking to take out on Christian tonight. Randy Orton wasting a little time roughhousing with Christian here. But with the viper off the heels of that concussion, it's a good to watch his footwork and how he moves in the ring. Drop. But we talk a lot about history. When it comes to the World Heavyweight Championship changing hands, most of those take place at WWE oh pay-per-view events. Okay. You know, you're right, James. Yeah. WWE brought the world again. title back in 2002. It has changed hands at a WWE pay-per-view on more than 20 occasions. And both of these men are students of this business, and I know they both know that statistic. And for this title bout, it's something Christian will use to give him added confidence and Randy Orton will use for added motivation. I think Randy Orton knows he has to end this early. And that the longer it goes, it doesn't necessarily bode well for him. Yeah, to me, Randy has to end this and end it soon. I don't know if Randy Orton is himself at this moment, but he knows he has to end this soon if he wants to leave our nation's capital the world anyway champion. I think somewhere there's a man that brought a lose. He's begging for it. Oh boy, here we go. All the way over the arc. KO. Oh man! Great counter. Here's the cover. Up to the leg. Oh, and a kick down. Oh, Kristen thought he had him there. Again, a very frustrated Christian. Got to be wondering what it takes to beat Randy Orton, or maybe he's wondering if he can beat Randy Orton. Look out! Went to the spear. Went up over the top, up to the arcade. Oh! oh. And Christian with a Spear! Oh! oh. You know, medically, it's not. You have to wonder if Randy Orton is feeling any of the effects after that concussion. Oh, this is Christian's night tonight, and really, a do-or-die situation for him. Yeah, I just don't know how Christian's going to react if he doesn't win. Well, look out. Oh, win to the turnbuckle. All right, Christian, great move. Now Christian going to go up top. He's flying. Oh, missed it. Oh, oh. oh. Randy Orton with an RKO. Here's the cover. Hook in the leg. And this one's over. Christian's number. Boy, how quick was that? Like lightning. 
Well, that's what we know about the Viper. He can strike at any given time, and he did. Christian's trying to say that his leg was underneath the bottom rope. That referee should have stopped some him. No, he made it right.
remember, very important stimulation here. Randy Orton has no champion advantage tonight because if he's disqualified, he'll lose the championship. Yeah, Christian's going to be licking his chops at this. And you know, Christian's a veteran. He knows how to push Randy Orton's buttons. He's going to try to do anything he can to go Orton into losing his cool. Here they go. Match is underway for the World Heavyweight Championship. Oh. What's, what's it doing here? Hey. And Christian wasted a little time trying to take advantage of the stipulation of this match. He just threw a steel chair into the ring and he's asking Orton to hit him with it. Orton can't hit him with it. Randy knows that. Look at Christian. Come on, right in the back. Blast me. Well, I'm sure Randy would want to, considering the issues between these two men. Yeah, but Randy does not want to lose his world championship that way. That's for sure. Which is going to have to be smarter than that. Yeah, nice try, Christian. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. Let's look at the resumes of both men. Randy Orton is an eight-time world champion. He won the 2009 World Rumble. He's won Intercontinental Championships, Tag Team Titles, and is a third-generation superstar. Wow, pretty impressive. The Viper has done it all in this business. But you know, Christian's not exactly a slouch either. Well, the man Christian, a one-time world heavyweight champion, a three-time Intercontinental Champion, and a nine-time Tag Team Champion. And you know all the statistics. The quick reversal here by Randy Orton. You know, both Christian and Randy Orton are respected veterans and champions. You can trace that back to their training and passion for this business. King, I don't know if you can have better trainers. Christian spent lots of time with WWE Hall of Famer Brett the Hitman Hart and the Viper with his WWE Hall of Fame father, Cowboy Bob Orton. Oh, you don't want to push Randy Orton too far. There's a reason he's the Apex Predator. The Viper's on the attack, however, it's important to keep in mind Randy Orton cannot be disqualified. Yeah, and if Christian thinks Randy Orton's going to let up at all because of the disqualification stipulation, he's got another thing coming. Loot this prank! Good Lord, what a series of strikes. match that I've ever seen. Think of all the great men who have been World Heavyweight Champion and all the incredible match types they've competed in. This disqualification stipulation was something we never thought we'd see. And just looking back at the other matches Christian and Randy Orton have had, each of them were so close for the fate of the world title to be decided by Randy Orton's anger pulling yeah. over. It was just unbelievable. Oh, oh, oh. Orton knows how dangerous Christian is. He's oh, pulling out all the stops. Yeah, you got to be on your toes with Christian at all times. He can hit you with anything from anywhere and at any time. Both men have those better instincts, but Christian's as sly as they come. Oh boy, or do they give him a knee? Oh man, Randy Orton looks like he's switching gears here. Randy Orton shows no absence of malice in control. Yeah, Randy Orton's poorly, and he's ready to strike. The kick connects. Oh. Remember, the champ board is taking this qualifier. He's going to lose 
the title. Bailey's got to be really careful here. And the referee up to a count of four. Now he's actually put Randy off instead of just walking oh. away. Oh, oh, yeah. oh. I think Christian spit Norton's face. The winner of this match as a result of a disqualification and the new world heavyweight champion, uh -huh. Christian.
Mick James is an old boy match. There are no rules here. And you know what I like about this, Cole? This makes the match the way it should be. Man on man, one on one, champion against champ. It'll also be interesting to see if Randy Orton's well-documented anger management issues will be a factor tonight. Oh, boy. Christian needs to refocus. Well, Christian was right, so well, confident be no because problem. he knew he had a safety net. He knew that he had his best friend Edge out here in his back pocket to watch his back. There's no way Christian's mind's going to be right after Edge just dumped him in the middle of the ring. As I mentioned before, Christian, he needs to refocus. Into the collar and elbow tie-up. Only one can come out ahead. world champion was Triple H in 2002. By that time, he was already a five-time WWE champion, whereas Randy Orton won his first world title in 2004 and didn't become a WWE champion until 2007. Yeah, and you know, Michael, that's what makes these discussions so interesting. Christian captured his first world title this year. Many are wondering if he, too, will join the list of elite who have held both the world championship and the WWE Championship. I, okay, I don't think anyone should right, question if Christian will become WWE Champion. Gordon with the Irish whip, but wait a minute! It's reversal from Christian! Ah, look at this! Oh, and a spinebuster! Here's the call! He's in and out of here! Look at the leg kick out! Oh, man, Gordon yeah. barely oh, able to get out after that oh, vicious spinebuster from Christian. What's oh, Christian going to do with Kane? I don't know, but he better take advantage of this situation. Wait a minute! Where's Christian going? Gordon is stunned! Christian outside the ring, he's looking for some. Oh no! A kendo stick, Cole! He's got a kendo stick! And he's climbing the top rope! Oh my gosh, Martin! You're in big trouble, buddy! Christian with a kendo stick! Oh my gosh! Oh, I dropped him! Nice! Can you believe that? Grapple Christian, he's Just look at this! On the you can see the All results right. from that move! Well, when it comes to SummerSlam and the World Championship, WWE Summer Classic has seen the prize title change hands on four occasions. Okay, going back to 2003. Oh, no, no, I don't like it when the action gets this close to us. Right, up, right here in front of us. Hey, wait, 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 wait a minute. Things are getting real out of control. Our table. No, wait. Come on, not my monitor. Oh. No, here goes yours. I mean, Christian is just hell bent on this. Oh, oh, wait, 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 face of Christian. What's he doing here? Christian's going to try an RKO. Nope. But wait. Oh. Oh. The fucker with an RKO of his own. And the entire table just collapsed. What an RKO. I tried to tell Christian that would come back to haunt him. Took a lot out of the Viper as well, though. Gordon staggering back to his feet. Look at that. Busted wide open! This is great! Right hand by Randy! He was able to reverse that! A textbook reversal! Can he follow up? And he gets 
escorted back to the ropes. He's got a nasty looking object in his hands. And this is going to return to the ring. And here's those vicious steel steps again. Oh no! SummerSlam is going to go through a It was at SummerSlam 2000 that he, along with his partner and best friend Edge, made the TLC match concept famous. Oh, they made it famous, all right. Edge and Christian defended their WWE World Tag Team Championship against two other teams. They created it. He's out. This is the psychological part of Walker's game, where he just batters and wears down as a run. Well, I'll get the devil is due. Christian can take it just as well as he can. The more punishment he takes, the slower and slower he is getting back to his feet. He thinks he has it. I'll do it for here. That's it. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I did. And if you like WWE 2K15, 2K Showcase, one more match, final part, please go and give us a thumbs up and please like this video. Leave a comment. And if you're brand new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and also not forget to tap that notification bell under my name, Brandon Martin. On the YouTube app, so you'll never miss an upload of a live stream. And well, that being said, I will see you guys for the next one, which will be going to Hall of Fame. Anyway, that's it. So I'll be back with that.